Hi, today I'll show you how to use a detail brush to make drops, arabesques, and leaves. To make fine designs, it is best to use acrylic paint. So first of all, you'll need to dilute your paint. You need to dilute it a lot and never work with a dry paint or else you won't be able to draw. For these designs, I will use two brushes just to show you that you don't have to use a very fine brush. So first dip your brush in the paint and remove the extra paint from your brush. Don't draw directly with fresh paint because there will be too much paint on the hair of the brush. So remove the extra paint to obtain a very fine brush. It looks as if there's no paint on the hair. So to make the drops, look at how I do it. First I draw a line without pressing on my brush. I drag the brush and gradually press on it. So I press and I remove it. Now I'll show you how I proceed with the second detail brush. To have the references of the brushes, you have to look at the video's description below. So I bend the brush in the direction of the drop. First I drag the brush without pressing on it, then I apply a pressure gradually and then I remove the brush. As you remove it, don't press on it, just pull up. So I drag the brush, press on it and I remove it. Here is a nail art example made of drops. Now let's talk about arabesques. To make arabesques, hold your brush vertically. Unlike drops, hold your brush very straight. If you don't do so, you will have a thick line. To obtain best results, you have to train yourself on this one because you will have to do it in one go. And of course your hand should not tremble. So better train yourself, there's no other solution for it. Unless you have a good support, put your hand on the table. If you're making the nail art for someone, find support on your little finger. To have a good support is very important. With some training you'll be able to do it at one go, without trembling. Now I'll show you that it can also be done with a big brush. The tip of the brush must be very sharp. Good quality brushes are well cut, but if you buy cheap brushes on eBay or whatever, you won't be able to work with them. Here's a mix of arabesques and drops. And now I will show you how to make leaves. So first paint a very fine line. Don't press on the brush to make a thin line. And then make a straight line. Do the same thing on the other side. Do not join the two lines. Then same, drag, press and then halfway join the two lines so that it looks like a leaf. But don't make a parenthesis. If you don't make straight lines, it will never look like a leaf. And of course, with big brushes, you'll be able to make bigger leaves. I use it usually for my feet nails. To clean your brush from acrylic paint, you have to use water. Don't worry about water, it will never damage your quality brush like Rublof. Do not use them with nail polish nor in nail polish remover. Or else you will ruin your brushes, use only water and use them only for paint. You can buy cheap eBay brushes if you'll use them with nail polish. When washed in water, I press the brushes in my hand to remove the residues caught in the iron. And about monthly, I add some cuticle oil, olive oil, lip balm or some fat because it's very important to hydrate natural hair. To protect them just like these ones that I own since a year now. I hope that this video has been useful to you. If you want to know more about the techniques that I use, just leave a comment below.